What advice do you have for a young man in his 20s? It's a pretty non-specific question. Make a plan. Look at what you're interested in. Get disciplined about something. Allow for the possibility that you have something important to contribute to the world and that the world would be a lesser place without that contribution. Don't be afraid of taking on responsibility. You're so... It's where you find what sustains you in your life. You can take on too much responsibility. You, you have to be cautious in that regard, but that's a less common problem than not taking on enough. A lot of the things that people regard as traps are actually the means to their life. You know, often young people are afraid of commitment, for example, in the context of a romantic relationship, and because they feel that that's going to interfere with their pursuit of something more valuable, but that's just not the case. It's, you're not going to find something more valuable in your life than a committed relationship with someone that you love that sustains itself across time and that in all likelihood produces children. That's life. And there may be people for whom avoiding that is the better route, but those people are very rare and you need a real reason to assume that you're one of those people. And hopefully for you, you're not. Um, you know, I've had a very good career, a very meaningful career in multiple dimensions. And it's still been the case for me that the most important part of my life has been my intimate relationship with my wife and my and my family. So don't be afraid of that or be afraid of it, but don't let that stop you from from pursuing it. What about like how how much do people have to kind of date around to find somebody, though, because it does take a bit of exploration to find somebody you're compatible with. So what's a reasonable amount of exploration and like by what age should people have figured it out? Because, I mean, there's always the grass looks greener. So at some point, maybe you should just settle down. But what are your thoughts on that? Well, life isn't very long. And so you don't get to evaluate that many relationships. You probably only have a five to 10 year period to do that, something like that. And then the reason you only have that amount of time is because it gets more and more difficult as you get older rather than easier, partly because people your age are increasingly in relationships. So I would say get at it. Don't don't overestimate the degree to which you have to find someone versus create the relationship. You know, there's many cultures, and I'm not I'm not suggesting that this is necessarily a desirable alternative. But there are many cultures that arrange marriages, and those arranged marriages frequently work. It's not obvious that they work less frequently than relationships or marriages that are predicated on romantic attraction. Um, which has its own pitfalls. Is that is no matter who you find, there are going to be full of flaws like you are, and so a lot of it is something you create. I think you want to find someone you can trust and someone that you're attracted to, and perhaps someone who shares the same ambitions as you do, or at least has ambitions that are compatible with yours. And then, well, then pretty much all of it after that is what you create rather than what you find. Mm -hmm.